Hey guys, it's Rose with Rose Likes Crochet. How is everybody doing? It is Wednesday, July 29th, 2020, and this is another video for Wishes for Wings. Uh, for those of you who are new here, Wings is a domestic violence organization here in the Chicagoland area. And what we're doing as a crochet community is this whole year we are sending in crochet donations. Um, so just a quick update on donations. For the month of July, our um, items were the regular things, uh, washcloths, dishcloths, hot pads, kitchen scrubbies, stress balls are always needed there. And then I've also been collecting um, six inch and 12 inch granny squares to make blankets. Um, now July is the last month that we're gonna accept granny squares and that's just because I have too many and I don't have time to make all the blankets. So we'll be making blankets probably for the rest of the year for wings, which is really exciting. But um, after this month, um, please don't send in any more granny squares. Um, we um, are going to update our item of the month for August. We're actually not gonna have an item of the month simply because uh, they're kind of transitioning in between summer, back to school, and fall. So currently we will not have an item of the month for August. Please feel free to continue to send in the dishcloths, washcloths, uh, stress balls, kitchen scrubbies, um, and more information will be in the description box down below. Okay, so as a reminder, everyone who donates for the month of July will get a free pattern from Malika at My Marvelous Crochet. So she is also linked down below. If you guys can please go and take a look at her channel, go and subscribe and go check her out. She's adorable. And um, we also had quite a few people send in some yarn. So we will also have at least one winner of some yarn for the month of July too. So for today, I actually have 23 donations, you guys. So I'm gonna try and get through this as quickly as possible. And I'm gonna do something a little unconventional. I have a bunch of boxes and then I have a bunch of bags that I laid out on my kitchen counter. And I think I'm gonna take the phone off the tripod and go and um, show you guys everything all laid out. So let's start with the boxes, okay? So this really, really, really large box <laughs> is from one of the people who I consider my friend here on YouTube. She um, comments on all my videos and I feel like I know her. Her name is Naomi. And she sent me a really long letter about why it's taken her so long to, to donate. You guys, seriously, stop that. Okay, so here's what she says. Hope all is well with you and carrots. Sorry I'm late getting this to wings. I've been busy working. My company I work for makes the parts for respirators for breathing machines needed for you know what. I've enclosed 12 inch squares, six inch squares, pencil cases. The pattern is by Laurel's Kitchen and Crochet on YouTube. Also, there are three crocheted belts patterned by Sarah Satch on YouTube. Hope Wings can still use them. Took her a long time to get the D-rings. She got yarn for me and um, a bracelet for Carrots. Carrots is my daughter. Well, her name's not Carrots, that's just her nickname. Um, she says, sorry, it's a frog, not a turtle, and two treats for Camo. Camo is my furry man of the house. He's a dog. Um, can't forget him. Thank you, Rose, for letting me help with donations for wings. I'll try to send more when I can for such a great cause. Okay, so no hurries, no worries. All right, so let me show you what she sent. Yay, two cupcakes. Woo! I love them. I'm actually using cupcakes on a project right now. She got some treats for Camo, my doggie. And this is a really, really adorable bracelet for my daughter. It's hard to see it, but um, I think she's gonna like it, thank you. We've got some pencil cases and these are amazing. I'm totally gonna go and check out that, that um, tutorial, Naomi. And then here are the belts. So great colors for men, and those are the D-rings that she's talking about. So we have three belts, and then she sent a ton of squares. Look at this, you guys, oh my gosh. So these are all the six inch squares, and, and then she sent like a whole pile of 12 inch squares. So Naomi, thank you so, so much. I really appreciate it. You guys never need to apologize, and you don't need to worry about sending things in on time. So. 
let me get to the next box. So this next box was completely overflowing and there was no name on it, but uh, someone named Amanda, hi Amanda, uh, sent me an email and said her sister had sent out the box and forgot to put a return address on it. And then she also forgot to put a note inside the box. So I think this is all from Amanda. Thank you so much, Amanda. She sent some bags. You guys, look at this. Great, oh, this is like a backpack, you guys. No, it's not a backpack. Oh my gosh, it's a drawstring bag. There we go adorable i love it thank you so much here is another one how cute is this oh it's adorable look at the top you guys oh my gosh you guys are so talented here is another bag you guys this is amazing i believe this is the crocodile stitch and i have attempted it once in my life <laughs> But this is amazing. It's beautiful. Thank you so much. Amanda also sent these gorgeous 12 inch squares. I'm going to show you um, if I can. Look at the pattern on that one, you guys. Oops, sorry about that. So there's a whole bunch like that. And then there's like the half and half granny. And there's one like that. They're just all beautiful. I cannot wait to put these in a blanket. Thank you so much. And then she actually sent a little butterfly. Now, for those of you who don't know, butterfly is the symbol for wings. So I am sure someone will love to hold on to this. Thank you so, so much for sending this, Amanda. All right, you guys, this next box is from Jan Kirk, and she also comments on all of my videos, and I feel like we know each other. Hey, Jan. And she sent this box full of goodies. She did send a card. Let me read the card to you. It says, thinking of you, and sorry, guys, I can't read. <laughs> Print is small. Dear Rose, I know your wings campaign has brought joy to so many. More of what we need in this world right now. I love seeing all the beautiful donations and just how much support your Yearny friends have given. Truly a blessing. I hope these little sunflower grannies bring a smile for the recipient when added to make a blanket. Thank you for all you do. And then she even put little sunflower stickers in there. Oh, oh my gosh, Jan, you're amazing. So look at this, you guys. She sent these big 12 inch ones. Beautiful. And then she sent in all of these. You know, I have to use these in a blanket. So all of those, they're so amazing. Now to top that off, she sent pencil cases. Now pencil cases was our thing for July. It was supposed to be for the whole summer. And she sent a whole bunch of pencil cases, but you guys, it, they're filled with stuff. All of these are filled with things. Let's just open up one of them and see what's inside, because I'm sure anything that's in here will help the kids. She's got pencils, pens, eraser, glue stick, and hand sanitizer. And I think she's got them in all of these pencil cases. So Jan, you are amazing and incredible. And thank you so much for filling up the pencil cases. I really, really appreciate it. She also sent a bag of, looks like a bag of beads. She says, I thought you might be able to use some of these beads for your stitch markers. Moving to a new house forces me to clean out my stuff. That is so nice of you, Jan. Thank you so much. I know I remodeled my house and we got rid of a lot of stuff when we did that. So I appreciate you sending all of this stuff. It's amazing. Thank you. This next box is from Joanne Russo and she actually lives in the Chicagoland area, just like me. Hey neighbor, what's up? So Joanne sent this adorable card. And it says, thank you. And remember guys, I'm thanking you for helping me with this project. So you don't need to thank me at all. She says, hi Rose, you have a bunch of granny squares to add to your collection. I kind of went overboard, LOL. So <laughs> you guys, this entire box is filled with granny squares. And they're beautiful just from looking at the ones on the top. And there are a ton of of granny squares here. So I am not gonna take them all out of the box. Um, what I've been doing is I've been leaving everyone's granny squares together because it's usually easier to put together the ones that came from the same person. <laughs> so thank you so much, Joanne, for sending this box of granny squares. I can see already that they're absolutely beautiful. Thank you so much. This next box uh, is huge and it came from Shirley and she is from Spokane, Washington. 
And you guys are not gonna believe what she put in here. She did give me a card. And it looks like it's, hand, oh, it is handmade, hand stamped, very nice. And she says, I'm sorry guys, I really can't see today. <laughs> Hi Rose, I really enjoy watching your channel. All of the donations are so pretty and amazing. You've done a great job putting together the granny squares. I'm sending a twin size corner to corner for wings, no assembling required, LOL. Also a dozen random pattern and colors for pencil cases. I heard you said you hadn't gotten any, so I thought I'd give it a try. Thanks for all you do for wings. God bless. Shirley. Shirley, you're the bomb diggity. Okay, so she put the pencil cases in this little zippered bag, and I'm just going to take the top one out, and she, oh my gosh, she filled them, you guys. <gasps> okay, so uh, it looks like they're all a little bit different. Like one has a button. Um, that one has a button. So they're all like different colors. Some have buttons, some have just this little strap. And then she put pencils inside. Oh, you are incredible. Thank you so much, Shirley. This is awesome. I'm gonna see if I can, I, we're doing um, a volunteer event with my uh, two Girl Scouts um, next weekend. So I'm gonna see, and they're giving out um, backpacks for back to school. So I'm gonna see if I can run this over there before then and see if they can use these. So thanks for this. All right, you guys, this is a, this is a beautiful blanket. Oh my gosh, I love corner to corner and I love this color. This is absolutely gorgeous. Shirley, you outdid yourself. Thank you so much. Oh my God, it is absolutely beautiful. And she put the tag on there so that they would know how to care for it. Um, but it is absolutely gorgeous. Thank you so much for donating a completed blanket. That is amazing. Thank you so much. This next box came from Josie Vega. And Josie is from California. Whoa, seriously, this is awesome. Here is the card. How adorable is that? And she says, um, I can read this one. Dear Miss Rose, please use these crochet squares for wings twin size blankets. I want to thank you for the opportunity to participate in this wonderful cause. All squares are acrylic machine wash and dry. There are 47 12 inch squares and 21 six inch squares. Thank you for all you do for others. I follow you on YouTube. Sincerely, Josie. Okay, so this is a blanket in a box, you guys. This is amazing. I'm short one square, but actually I'm not because look at this, you guys. So here are the six inch squares and I'm gonna just show you. It's filled to the top, you guys. This is all 12 inch squares in here. That is incredible. And then to top it off, like she had to do this, right? She sent me this adorable little pin. Oh my gosh. It says, yarn queen. So thank you so much, Josie. I so appreciate you making all of these squares, all of these six inch squares and your, your wonderful words. Thank you so, so much. Here's another huge box. Liz, this is from Liz and she is from Arizona and she is incredible. This is a huge box. Let me show you guys the card that she sent. Check out that card, you guys. And it's like a foam card, so it's super thick and squishy. Oh my goodness, that's awesome. <laughs> Thank you, Liz, for the cool card. She says, hi, Rose, hope all is well with you and Carrots. Again, Carrots is just the nickname for my daughter. I'm sending you some six inch and 12 inch squares for wings and a couple more bags. I've also included a little purple surprise for you. Lots of love, Liz. And um, she is hooked with love by Liz. So if that is her YouTube channel, I'll link it below. Um, it, might be her Instagram, but I will put that information down below, you guys. So let me show you what she sent. Okay, here are the bags. Oh my gosh, they're so cool. This is really, really soft, you guys. Ooh, what kind of yarn is this, Liz? <laughs> let me know. It's super soft, so a little tote bag. And then here is another tote bag, and it's she sent some 12 inch squares and they are beautiful. Look at that. Oh my gosh, absolutely gorgeous. 
All right, I'm not gonna take all these out of the bag, but look at all of these six inch squares. I see sparklies. Oh, and here are some more six inch squares. She's got it stocked, you guys. Wow, amazing. Oh my gosh, wait, there's another bag of six inch squares. And these are all like purples and grays. Oh my gosh, this is incredible. This is probably like a third of a blanket. <laughs> And then she also sent, let's see what's in this bag. These are dishcloths because they are cotton. Uh, here is a little tiny itty bitty one. Oh, those are regular granny squares, you guys. No, here's another dishcloth. Okay, I knew I saw cotton in there. So there's a dishcloth and then a couple more squares that she probably couldn't squeeze into the bag. So Liz, thank you so much. This is incredible. I so appreciate you sending all of these items. And um, wow, just floors me. Oh, you guys, here's the purple yarn she sent. <laughs> Winter nights, ooh, sparkly. Thank you for the yarn, I appreciate it. Okay, let's get to the next box. All right, here's the next box. This is from one of my favorite people here on YouTube. Um, by the way, I don't call you guys subscribers, I call you my friends. Um, I hope that you consider me your friend too. Uh, this is from Maria and she is from New Jersey. Hey Maria. And she's got a little note. The note says, here is what I promised, a box of squares, 80 of them. I didn't get to send this one I wanted to, so I hope it's not too late. Stay safe, your yarny friend Maria. Maria, it's not too late. <laughs> Again, I'm not gonna take these out of the box, but you guys, check it out. 80 granny squares. So it normally takes me 150 something to make a twin size blanket. So this is pretty much half of a blanket in a box. So Maria, you are the bomb diggity. Thank you so much for sending all of these squares. You're incredible, thank you. This next box is from Joyce Meyer and she is from New York, New York. And she sent me a card what you do matters and what you guys do matter too thank you so much she says hi rose thought you might like these pot holders love watching you and seeing all the great things that are sent to you hope you can use these love from new york joyce okay so i'm, I'm not going to take them out of the box but you guys they are all right i'm going to take a few out because you guys have to see them i believe they're all the same design and they're absolutely gorgeous so they are these with the ridges and the little holder on the top. Check this out, you guys. And there are like a gazillion in this box. Oh my gosh, this is like the next pattern that I want to uh, focus on. I love this. I think this is a Jada in Stitches pattern. Um, and I might have even linked this in the Wings playlist, and that is in the description box down below. So. Oh my gosh, Joyce, they're absolutely beautiful. Thank you for taking the time to make these. I really appreciate it, and I'm sure the people at Wings appreciate it too. Thank you so much. This next box is from Angie Rhodes, and she is from North Carolina, and that's a pretty big box, and she's got a note in here. She says, Rose, here are some six inch and 12 inch squares for a blanket for Wings. The Yarn Bee Katarina yarn is a gift for you to use however you would like. When I saw that it was made up of purples and named Regal Rose, I thought of you immediately. My squares aren't the best, but I'm self-taught with YouTube tutorials. I've only been crocheting for six years and just learned how to read a pattern. Woo woo! Thank you for choosing a great cause to donate to, Angie Rhodes. Angie, your stuff is gorgeous, and it doesn't matter how long you've been crocheting for, you take your time, you practice, you master it, you'll be just fine. Um, so you guys, for someone who's a new crocheter, she did a pretty good job. She sent all of these granny squares. These are the six inch ones. Incredible. Here's the yarn. Oh, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. It's purple. All right, and then I'm gonna show you guys because I want you to, I want, when you guys leave a comment here, I'm hoping that everyone who donates actually reads the comments because I want everyone to send positive messages to the people who are donating. Um, and maybe that will encourage other people to donate too. Um, so 
let's let Angie know how good she did. <laughs> look at that, it's beautiful. And look at the sparkles. Okay, I'm totally down with that. Look at the colors on that one. Now, I don't usually do this, but for someone who's a new crocheter, you guys have to see what a good job she does. Wow, look at this one. They are absolutely beautiful. 12 inches, gorgeous, and there we go. So Angie, I am very proud of you. You did a great job. I appreciate you sending in what you sent in, and um, yay, Angie. <laughs> All right, we have one more really big box and then we're gonna get to the packages. You guys, this monster box is from Karen and she's from North Carolina. <laughs> this is incredible what she sent. I'm gonna read you the card first. There's the card, it's all sparkly and pretty. She says, hi, Rose and Carrots, hope you are both doing good. Included in the package are two twin size blankets. I used Red Heart and I love this yarn. The skeins of yarn are for you or for a giveaway. Thank you for all you do in organizing this project from Karen. Karen, you are the bomb diggity. So I'll just show you the yarn to get it out of the way. She sent Hello Gorgeous and she sent, ooh, Willow Dappled. Okay, so I haven't used this before, so I'll have to take a look at it and see if I wanna make anything with it. So she sent all this yarn. You guys, she sent two twin size blankets vacuum sealed. Seriously, amazing. Here's the other one. <laughs> so I'm gonna unseal these and I'm gonna show you what you they guys, look like. These are incredibly beautiful. They're made with 12 inch granny squares. And this is the first one. I'm gonna try and show you as much of it as I can. Um, but they're twin size. So you guys, when I make the twin size blankets, I use 48 12 inch squares. So here is, <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so beautiful. And it's like all purples. You guys, it's gorgeous. Um, I'm gonna try and see if I can put these on my bed, on a queen size bed and show you what they look like. Or um, I don't know how else to show you. You know what, I'm gonna put them on my couch because there's something on my bed. So here is one of them and I'll insert a picture here. And here is the other one and it's so pretty. It's blues and greens and a little bit of purple with gray. Oh my gosh, these are absolutely incredible. Holy mackerel. Okay, I'm gonna lay this one down on the bed and I'll put a picture right here of what this one looks like. Karen, thank you so much for sending two twin size blankets plus all that yarn. That was absolutely incredible and so thoughtful of you to put that together for us. So, all right, so I'm gonna take the camera off the tripod and I have all the other packages laying on the kitchen counter. I don't know, you can probably see some of them. And I'm gonna walk over there. Hopefully my camera skills won't be too shaky and I'm gonna show you what everyone else sent because there is a lot, hang on. Okay, you guys, so the first package that I have here is from Mary, and she sent a card, and her card says, thank you for all you do for wings. I've been watching you for a few months now and wanted to send you a few granny squares. They were fun to make. I forgot about having to weave in my ends. That's why you got a few solids, LOL, from Mary. Okay, so you guys, she sent all of these six inch squares, and then she also sent the 12 inch squares. So Mary, thank you so much. I really appreciate you sending them and taking the time to weave in all your ends. That's awesome, thank you. This next set of uh, mail was from Katie and she's from Ohio. And she left me a little note and it says, Rose, I made some squares from my scraps. I hope they get to you in time from Katie in Ohio. So here are all of the squares that Katie sent and they're absolutely beautiful. I love them. Thank you so much, Katie. All right, so this next set of squares is from Elaine and Elaine wrote a long card. 
Uh, it's got a little butterfly on it. And she says, hi, Rose, thank you for accepting my little donation and putting it towards a blanket for wings. You have inspired me to reach out to local organizations that I could put my crochet skills to work a great, to uh, help a great cause. When I heard this was the last month for Granny Squares, I literally, literally shouted, what? And got to work. It has been a while since I made one and I forgot how enjoyable and quick it is. All the best to you and carrots from Elaine. P.S. Thanks again for all the stitch markers. You're welcome, Elaine, and thank you for ordering them. So Elaine sent two of these little six-inch granny squares and then all of these 12-inch granny squares. How beautiful. Elaine, thank you so much. I really appreciate you sending them. Thank you. So this next bag is from Josephine from North Carolina, and she sent me a little note. And it says, thank you for using these squares in your blankets. God bless you, Josephine. Thank you so much, Josephine. So she sent a ton of six inch squares. You guys, you guys know how to fit stuff inside envelopes, I tell you. <laughs> and a lot of uh, these 12 inch squares too. So Josephine, that is amazing. Thank you so, so much for sending them. They're so soft and I love the colors. Thank you so much. So this next bag is from Jennifer and she is from Missouri. There was no card, which is totally fine. You guys don't have to put a card in there. But look at these adorable pencil pouches she made. Oh my God, they're little mermaid tails. So she made one, two, three of these little mermaid tail pouches. And then she made a little bag here. And then she made these zippered pouches. Look at that, it's like an apple slice. Oh my gosh, how adorable are these? Look at this, you guys. It's like the little leaf. And this is a zippered pencil pouch. And then she made this granny square pouch too. Oh my gosh, this is incredible. Thank you so much. I'm gonna have to run these over there um, as well so they have these in time for the backpack giveaway. So thank you so much, Jennifer. So this next bag was from Taylor and she's from Pennsylvania. And she sent me this card and the card says, Rose, I hope that you and Carrots are doing well and staying safe. I wanted to get this uh, donation in sooner, but I have been super busy with nursing school. There was no time. Well, school definitely comes first. Anyways, these are the squares I have made as well as some hot pads. The solid squares are from a project I never got to finish and they just so happen to be purple. Ha! Best wishes from Taylor. So you guys, here are the hot pads. That's really cool. There's another one. They're absolutely beautiful. And here are the squares that she sent. There's the purple ones. I love them. Thank you so much, Taylor. Gorgeous work. Thank you. All right, so this next bag is from Teresa Moan. Hey, Teresa. And she sent a lot, a lot of granny squares. Check that out, you guys. There's no card, but again, you guys don't have to send a card as long as your name is on there. I'm all good to go. This is amazing. This is like a ton. This is like 50 granny squares. So Teresa, thank you so, so much for sending in all of these squares. It's awesome. I really appreciate it. All right, this next box came, or bag came from uh, Daniels and they are from New York and she sent in a ton of 12 inch granny squares and they're all different patterns and they're very, very beautiful. Wow, incredible. Thank you so much for sending these in. I really, really appreciate it. This will help with a lot of twin size blankets. Thank you so much. Um, I did have another bag from a friend and she donated two bags, but she did ask to keep her donation anonymous and she did not want to be a part of the giveaway. And you guys always have that option. You do not have to enter into the giveaway. You can opt out of that. And you also can be anonymous as well if you would like. So um, you know who you are, who sent the two bags. I really appreciate it and I love you. Thank you so much. So this next bag was from Renee and she is from North Carolina and she sent a card 
Every day is a new inspiration. And she writes, uh, Shalom, hey Rose, I am a fellow Jew who loves to crochet. What's up, fellow Jew? <laughs> I love what you're doing and knew I had to send some granny squares even though they're my worst enemy, haha. -ha. After I made a few, I started liking it and ended up with 26. Okay, so 26 granny squares for someone who doesn't like making them, that's awesome. She says, I've been trying to find places that accept donations near me, but everyone has plenty, thankfully. Anyway, so happy to finally find a way to give back. Thanks for all you do. Love, Renee. So Renee sent all of these beautiful granny squares. Thank you so much, Renee. You did a phenomenal job on those. Way to go, girl. Thank you. All right, so this next bag is from Dana, and she is from Texas. And you can see already those squares are uh, amazing. And she sent a little note and it says, Hi Rose, thanks for your good work. Here are a few six inch squares. I hope you can put them to good use from Texas and Dana. So here are the squares she sent and they're all in, I think that red art neon stripes and they are so, so beautiful. Dana, these are incredible. Thank you so much for sending them. I love them. I really appreciate that. Thank you so, so much. All right, this next bag came from Melissa and she is from Michigan and she sent this beautiful card. And the card says, Hi Rose, this is just four squares. I'm working on a twin that will be put together before I send it. And there will be the other, other things coming with the box I sent. Thank you for what you are doing. Sincerely, Melissa. P.S. Took the cast off to make the blanket, LOL. So it looks like she was injured and finally got the cast off enough to make a blanket. So you know what, you guys? You don't ever have to apologize for sending one or two squares or one washcloth or one scrub. Everything that you send is very, very much appreciated. Thank you so much. So here are her squares, and they are beautiful. I love the colors, and it's a great job. And thank you so, so much, Melissa. And Wendy is from California, so let me show you the first package. She sent me notes. So let me, let me show you the first package. She did leave me a note in both packages. She says, hello, Rose and Carrots. Here are some squares and dishcloths for wings. I will be sending more items, but I wanted to make sure I get the squares to you before the end of July. Thank you, Wendy. Okay, so here she sent like all of these squares, you guys. Nice, solid colors. That is gonna be so helpful when I'm making blankets. And then she sent these beautiful, oh my gosh, you guys, look at star-shaped. How cool is that? That is incredible. Okay, and then she sent another bag <laughs> and another note and it says, hello, Rose and Carrots. Thank you for all the hard work you are doing for Wings. I am very happy to help you support such a great place. I know the granny squares are not very fancy, but I hope that they are okay. I wanted to make more, but I wanted to make sure you receive them this month. Please take care and stay safe from Wendy. And then she has a note to Carrots. Carrots, how is your bearded dragon? Okay, so the dragon is fine. He just had his annual checkup and uh, he's a fatso. So um, one day I will show him to you guys. <laughs> All right, so that is it for the packages. Let me turn the camera back you guys, around. How incredible was that? Oh my gosh, I can't believe we had 23 packages. That was awesome. Um, so I do have two blankets that I put together. Um, now the first one that I'm going to show you actually was mostly already complete. Um, this blanket was sent to me from Jax and she is has a YouTube channel on here called Creations by Jax. So I'm going to link her channel in the description box down below. Now her blanket was pretty perfect. The only thing I had to do is make it a little tiny bigger. So I added a border around it. So the only thing that I did was add a white border. So let me show you the blanket. Okay, so here is the blanket that Jax made. She even put a little tag on there that said it was made by her and how to wash it. And her squares were absolutely beautiful. She did 12 by 12 squares and they were incredible. So you guys, the only thing I added to this was a white border all the way around and that was just to make it twin size so everything else here Jax did and she did a phenomenal job so i'm going to insert a picture of it on the bed so you can see what it looks like
All right, so for those of you who follow me on Instagram, you've already seen this blanket because I just posted it yesterday. Um, but this blanket was actually kind of started by another YouTuber here. Her name is Chris, and I will link her channel down below. And she sent me a whole bunch of red, white, and blue squares. And so then other people were like, well, I want to send some red, white, and blue squares too to match them, <laughs> those squares. So I actually had enough red, white, and blue Americana themed squares to make an entire twin size blanket so here is the blanket and again you guys it's really hard to show it <laughs> just from sitting in a chair but it's really cool because there's some like camouflage in there and there's like two with flags on it here's like a glorious granny um, it's just so so cool to see this Americana blanket so I have some pictures of this and I will insert them here Okay, you guys, so that's all I have for today. That was a lot of stuff. Um, I will be at the post office again before the end of the month so we can make sure we have all of our July donations in. Remember, you can send washcloths, dishcloths, scrubbies, uh, stress balls, um, uh, face scrubbies, dish scrubbies, I already said that, washcloths, dishcloths, yes. So, um, and more information is in the description box down below. So don't forget to leave a comment, a positive comment for everyone who has donated um, and everyone who's thinking about donating. Give them some encouragement, it's a great thing. Um, domestic violence is probably never gonna end, but we can do our part to help the people who are the victims. So thanks a lot, you guys, and we'll talk to you later, bye. Mm -hmm.